Okay, yes, word is going to spread like wildfire, and people will be like, oh my god. Oh my god, a paint stream! I'm going to explain to you why the Dark Souls Online is just terrible. All right, we're going to start like this, okay? You start, and you can be a human being, okay, who's alive and happy, okay? And you have, like, blue eyes and stuff, and you're just happy and stuff and junk. Look how happy he is, because he's human and he's alive. Now, there's this thing that can happen to you called dying, okay? And that makes you all hollowed and evil or upset or sad or a ghost or something. It's... It's never really truly uh, explained, but it makes you very sad. Okay, so you're you become hollowed, and then you're you're very sad, like a big a big C, and your nose goes like this. Okay, and and your your eyes your eyes are like green or something. All right, so this guy's hollowed. So there's no way when you're hollowed to have your friends come in the game these are your friends you can have like two friends or something I think okay so this guy who wants his friends and this guy who also wants his friends okay but this guy no can have his friends which is why he's so sad and looking at his friends because he no can has friends. See? He's looking at his friends. <laughs> and he can't have them. You can't invite people into your game if you're hollowed. So, hollowed's can't invite people into their game. Hollows, however, can be invited into other games. So, let's say this guy's a hollow. It's the only way to become a happy hollow, is by going into other people's games. Whereas this one is uh, a regular human. We'll make him white, because we'll stick with that theme. So, this one's a happy human. Happy. And this one's now a happy hollow. Okay. Hollow as in bleach. Hollow as in you're dead. So you don't have a soul, I guess. You're soulless. Your soul's elsewhere. Now, when you're hollow, you can eat humanity, which makes not much sense, but you can... If you... If you... Okay. Let's see. So, hmm... If you take humanity and you shove it into your mouth, humanity for some reason is this black, angry looking thing that looks like this. It looks kind of like a really messed up VJJ because it has like these white streaks around it and stuff, and it has like a white clitoris right here. If you take this, plus your mouth plus your mouth which is sad then it will equal human so that's what you have to do in order to get people into your game okay but that's not where it ends the where it ends and where it becomes extremely frustrating is that there are all these things in the way so you have the big mean boss right if the big mean boss is in your level and he's right here there he is you need him alive plus you to be human plus you to be human, plus 
you being in the same exact server as your friend who is human plus your friend who is hollowed in order to play. Now, let's say for some reason, this one has a penis, I guess. Let's say for some reason you are on a different server. So the boss needs to be alive. Let's scroll out. Yes, excellent. Let's grow this. All right. So under this, this right here, okay, this right here allows you to play together. The boss is still alive. You're a human. This is you. Plus your f same server. You have to be plus you are in, okay, you're in this server. We'll say this is this is the servers, okay? We'll say this is the servers. These squares represent the servers. This guy's in the same server. This guy's in the same server. Okay, equals, you get to play together, which is like, mm-hmm, yay, 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 and yay, your hollowed friend here who's extra happy because it's the only way he can get to play with people. So happy! Now, if by any chance you have a boss that's alive plus you who is alive and in this server okay plus your friend who logged in at the exact same time as you but for some reason is in a different server because this is you are here and he is here then equals no no sale you can't be together and if you want him to go into this server then now we're down to him having to go here and quitting the game plus turning off his console PS3 or what have you so we'll turn it off plus restarting his console make it green now plus 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 you have to take your hands and put them together like this and you have to pray to God that you will even have a shot at ever playing with your friends ever because the chances of this happening are so extremely slim that it's probably never going to happen now let's say all this happens and God answers you and is like yay and now you're on the same server and you're like, yay, I can see your writing on the wall because you have to drop down this thing. So he's now in the server, okay, plus your other friend is in the server. Yay, he's in the server. Yay. Okay, plus the other friend is, okay, so they're both here. We'll, 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 put, we'll put him over here also, okay. But... For some reason, because it's been an hour of you trying this, 
your other friend didn't know, so he continued and tried later, so he went and he killed the boss. Now the boss is dead, and the boss has given you his souls and his, his head's chopped off. Okay? Boss is dead. Boss is dead. Now, because that boss is dead, you can't play together. Do you understand? This never ends with you being able to accidentally play together. You, you can't. Everything has to fall in perfect line for you to play together. Now, you continue. You all continue on. None of you are playing together. You all decide, let's go on to the, where the next boss is. So you all go to the next place. The boss is alive. He's alive. The new boss is alive. He's happy because he's alive. Yay, I'm happy. But because you've been playing for a while, now you are here. And because you phased through something, your freaking friends are now here. And this one's over here. But you don't know it. And you're just standing in a room over here, putting down your stupid white soapstone, praying to God that someone comes through it. And your friends are standing in the same room, seeing nothing but red and orange fucking writing that other people have placed before them that says stupid things like, I did it. And things like that. I did it. Or or such preambles of enjoy the gorgeous view. Or such preambles as oh, I don't know. Need a head. I saw that one. Or 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 maybe um it says I can't take this because that's how I oops that, that's how I was I couldn't take it anymore so now you're back into we need to start over and you're back into this where you're like the boss is alive you're in the wrong server you need to quit you need to turn off your PS3 you need to turn it back on again and pray and you just keep doing this Trying to get on the same server. And meanwhile, in real life, you are over here with a TV here, and a TV here, and a TV here, and you're all sitting right next to each other, playing, using televisions, and different PlayStations or Xboxes that are all connected to the exact same fucking router. This is an actual problem that the game has. This actually happens. You'll be in the exact same room, absolutely unable to play with each other, because the only way to play with each other is by playing online through the system that they've built that makes it nearly impossible to join each other's game. That, my friends, is Dark Souls. That's Dark Souls, the true story. The true story.